What's up everybody? Frank here with another video. Today I'm going to show you how to fully install Cody 17.6 onto your device with a nice build that works very smoothly. I know we're still upset about Terrarium not working perfectly but it's out there but Cody 17.6 I'm going to show you how to install it really quick onto your device. So from y'all that's just getting started or brand new Fire Sticks make sure you make an account make sure you also connect your debit card or credit card to the account you don't have to pay for anything but just so it works so it has it on file okay so the first thing you want to do when you get to this screen is come over to the right to the settings option next thing you want to do is come down scroll over till you see device click on device next you want to come down to developer options and click on that you also want to turn on ADB debugging and you want to turn on apps from unknown sources. Without this, it won't be able to do anything. So turn it on. Both of these should be on. If you have a Fire TV, it's going to be one more selection. You want to turn that on as well. All right, once you do that, you can hit the home button. It's going to take you all the way back to the main screen. You want to come over to the left. And we're going to download an app called Downloader. Very helpful and very good for this situation. So make sure you download this. As you see, after you type in DOW, it pops up at the bottom. Let's click on it. Downloader third one from the top and it's going to bring up this orange app right here we're going to click on it and then we're going to install it so like I said if you don't um, connect a debit card or credit card it won't let you download some of these free apps you just need it on file so it can help you download things you know alright so once it downloads you want to click on open now I'm going to show you a nice way to install Kodi is by going to their website so it's very easy. We're going to type in Cody.tv, which is if you're typing on a computer, you're typing the same thing. I know a lot of people are giving you other file links and other nonsense to go to, but this is the to go straight to the source and download the app, download the um, Cody straight from there. Sorry. So once you type that in, cody.tv forward slash download, hit go. It's going to take us to the website. It's going to take us right to where we need to go. This is the Cody website, which has everything that we need. So since we're doing Android, we want to come over to the Android. As you can see, the little green thing. We're going to click on that. And it's going to take us to the recommended to, to download. As you can see, I got some pre-releases, which is Cody 18, which is not fully developed yet. So... It's no really point in getting in until it's ready to go. This one, sorry. Sorry about that. It only takes a little two, two more minutes. All right, once you do that, I'm going to come up to the right, click on install. All right, once that finishes, you want to come up to the right, click on open. All right, as you can see, Cody 17.6, Krypton. We are still with Cody 18. All right, so once we get to the screen right here, we're good to go. We got Cody, it's installed, but now we want to add a bill so we can watch the TV shows and movies. So the first thing you want to do is come over to the top left-hand side of your screen, screen and click on this setting screw. All right, once you do that, you want to come over to System Settings, scroll down to Add-ons, turn both of these on, click Yes. Both of these should be white on the right-hand side of your screen, and it should say Install Updates Automatically. Once you do that, you want to hit back once, come down to File Manager, come down to Add Source, and then you want to click on None. This is where we're going to type in our URL to get us the build that we want. Take your time. I know it's a little hard to type with these uh, fancy remotes. Sorry. So if it doesn't work, just know you made a mistake, okay? Don't, don't panic. All right, there we go. So we're good to go. 
We're gonna come up to the top and click on AJ to see if we did it right, which we did, it should say repository. So we're gonna hit back, hit back again, and come to the main screen. Once we do that, we're gonna come down to add-ons on the left-hand side of your screen, click on it. Come to the top left-hand side of your screen, click on the installation box. Come down to install from zip file. Click on .aj, and then click on repository AJ zip. It's gonna load up. Once we get this pop-up on the top right of our screen, we wanna to go to install from repository. Then we're gonna go down to AJ's repository. We wanna to come to program add-ons, and then click on AJ's wizard, click on install. It's gonna load up. All right, it says it's installed. Once it's installed, hit back to the main screen. Come down, as you can see, if under add-ons, you'll see the wizard to the right. Just click on AJ's wizard. All right, after that introduction, you wanna come down to AJ's builds and click on that. And you want to come to, you're going to let it load up for a second. And you want to click on AJ Box. All right, once that finishes, what you want to do is hit OK. It's going to force close Cody. Yes, close. We can delete this. We don't need this anymore. Delete just takes up space on our uh, device. So when we come to the home screen, what we want to do is, what I like to do is come down to your apps and, your apps and channels, you say something else. And then what we want to do is see all, and then we want to move Cody all the way to the front so it's easy to access. So you're going to click it with the three dashes on your remote. It's going to say move to front, click on that. Now if you hit the home button on your remote, you'll see it's always going to be right here. No matter if it's not on your recents, it'll be right here at first. So click on Cody, it's gonna open up. It's gonna load up. And it's gonna show the new build that you just installed, which is AJ's build. And it's gonna have show you a nice layout. Once you get a new build, you wanna wait two to three minutes to let everything load up. Uh, let everything, all the add-ons and all the updates load up perfectly so it'll be easy to use. As you can see at the bottom, we have a nice little menu down here. We got kids, sports, live TV, TV shows, movies, power settings, apps. A lot of things that go from the bottom. It shows how easy it is to access. As you can see, if you come to movies, you have multiple different add-ons that you can choose from right here. Uh, I know a new popular one is Yoda right here. If you click on, oops. I don't know what I clicked on, but we'll see. Like I said, you want to wait two to three minutes to let everything load up. As you can see at the top, it's going to say skin, shortcuts, building menu. Then after that, it's very self-explanatory. If you've been using Cody for a while, you know how to use it. Um, very easy. We got different things down here. All the live TV. Sports is very, very hot right now with um, uh, football being back and baseball and his playoffs and things of that nature. Got a kids section. It's not loading up until it finishes at the top and it will get a picture. <laughs> You got a kids section, everything. But if you want to see what all the apps it comes with, all you have to do is come over here to apps and then go to video add-ons. If you click on video add-ons, it's going to take us to another screen which should show all the apps that come with the build. If you're looking for a specific app or APK, it should be under this section. Everything that comes with the build should be under here, easy to find. And you can choose what you want to do to watch your TV shows and movies. You can come under here and use this information. Oops. I hit the wrong button but that's all it really takes to install Cody and to install a build onto your system very simple easy to use if you have any questions let me know you should already know how to pick your TV shows and movies if you want me to go in more in depth let me know um, I'll continue bringing you out things daily or every week things of that nature so let me know if you have any questions make sure you subscribe and like the video and make sure you have a blessed blessed day